Welcome to my unboxing of the RAM that I would choose, but it would be for the shallowest possible reasons. So, the thing about Corsair products is they're kind of like, okay, well here's our, here's our product, and then here's our extremely premium product, and pretty much no matter what you buy, you know you're getting Corsair quality, so, you know, you could potentially buy like, you know, a vengeance kit and you're still getting Corsair quality, you're still getting a lifetime warranty. So you got that going for you. So for me, what it comes down to with their performance stuff is it's all about sex appeal. Dominator Platinums are so sexy. This is like the heaviest RAM I've encountered in a very long time. And it is also just it looks so good. So here, hold on. Oh, don't look at it yet. Don't look at it yet. Okay. Okay. Iconic heat spreader design with customizable light bar. Upgrade kits available at Corsair.com. Okay. Cool stuff. So you can actually make it so it like matches and integrates in your system even better. Okay. Supports Corsair Link technology, which means you can monitor your memory performance, and that's cool too. Dual path DHX cooling technology for optimized heat dissipation. This we've had for a long time since the uh, Dominators and their, uh, their other DHX models as well. So now let's get into the memory itself. So this particular kit, there's nothing that special about the spec. This is an 1866 kit. It's uh, 2 by 8 gig. It's CL9, 1.5 volts. So yeah, it's a good memory kit. But it's not like, you know, their, their crazy Dominator Platinum kit that was clocked at, what, what was it, 2.8 gigahertz or something stupid like that? You know, I'm going to go look it up in a sec. Yeah, 3 gigahertz. So this is not that kit. This is just sort of your, your mainstream slash performance-y, like still a very good SKU memory. But, like, look, oh, look at it when you put it in a motherboard, though. Okay. So you get like your Republic of Gamers board from ASUS and you got like that dominator thing going on on the top. So the customizable light bar is the one that if you guys know anything about me, you know I love case lighting. And uh, all you have to do to change out the light bar so you can actually see, these ones are white. So they have like a, um, a frosted strip so that it dissipates the light in a pretty, pretty cool way. You've also got heat sinks for heat dissipation. This can be removed using, uh, using a, is that Torx or Allen key? It looks like an Allen key. So, uh, so no difficulty there. There's your Corsair link. So they're using a custom PCB. This is a very customized memory module. You can actually see the traces have been used. And what that means is not that Corsair shipped me a used kit, but that Corsair actually, you know, still believes in testing their memory, which is a very nice and reassuring thing to see because, you know, in this industry that's always cost down, cost down, you still want to know that there's premium products out there that look so good. I'm sure Slick's camera angles are almost as good as mine. You know, we have to power these on. We have to see the lights. So we're in the dark, ready to power the... Oh, so sexy. Okay, I'll take it. I'm taking the camera from Slick. He sucks at it anyway. <laughs> so that's what they look like when they're powered on in the dark. So beast. Love it. You even get like an, like an underglow effect around the, uh, the memory slots and all that as well. So you check that out. Anyway, thank you for checking out this unboxing. And don't forget to subscribe to Linus Tech Tips for more unboxings, reviews, and other computer videos, even shallow ones like this. Still admiring it. Okay, I'm done now.